In this video, I will show how to enable FTP in a cPanel server. By default, FTP is disabled on cPanel service. To verify, go to the terminal, search for terminal, click on the terminal link. FTP use port 21. We can use the netstat command to see if port 21 is in use. netstat minus LNTP. This command will list all listening ports. To see if port 21 is in use, we can use pipe grep 21. We don't have any service running on port 21. To install FTP, search for FTP on the WHM sidebar. Then click on FTP server selection. Here, as you can see, FTP is disabled. We have two options, Pro FTPD and Pure FTPD. Pro FTPD, there is some disadvantage, use more memory. Login notifications not available. We will go with the Pure FTPD, that is fast login time, use less memory, better security models. So select the option Pure FTPD, then click on Save. Now WHM is installing Pure FTPD. The installation process is completed. FTP server conversion complete. Let's go to the FTP configuration interface. You can change FTP server related settings here. Allow anonymous FTP login now. To see the FTP is working or not, we can create a test account. Go to the home. Create a new account. FTP test dot server ok dot in this will be our FTP username and we will generate a password password generator I have copied this password in safe place use the password scroll down click create now it will show the FTP server login details to verify let us connect with an FTP client I have file Scylla for the host, we will use IP address. If you have the domain name pointed, then you can use the domain name itself. I don't have this domain pointed to this IP address. So I will be using the IP address. Copy the IP address. Next, you have to enter the username. This is our username. Copy it. Paste it here. Then the password. Now you can click on the Quick Connect. We are now connected to the FTP server. On cPanel server, we upload the files to public underscore HTML. To go to the folder, double click the public underscore HTML directory. We are now inside the public underscore HTML. To upload a file, you can just drag and drop here or select a file from the local computer. On the right side, you will see the remote side. On the left side, it is the local computer. I will go to my home directory. That is home, then username. You can see my local files here. I will upload one of the file to the server. The file is uploaded. Thank you for watching. Hope you find the video useful. If you like the video, please subscribe for more videos like this.